what's up everyone so i'm sitting kind of far away from the camera so if the audio is like not good or whatever i'm sorry don't sister slit my throat <laughs> as we all know um i am grounded so to make my time go by i have been making these bracelets right here that you guys can see and i even made one for my ankle i don't know if you guys can see it she's super cute but i just thought i would share my mini talents with you guys and teach y'all how to make these super super classy nice cute bracelets they're actually like really cute all jokes aside they just look like this and then this one looks like this and my ankle one i don't know if you guys can see it but it just looks like oh my god it just looks like this and then i put beads on it so yeah if you want to know how to make these super super cute um like little bracelets then just continue watching to make these bracelets you're gonna need embroidery floss um i have a shit ton of embroidery floss yeah i just have 20 and then i have like i think i have some more but it's like those are like vibrant colors and that's not really my style like i don't know in the summer i'll probably do more vibrant style ones but i just like the like like warm tone like cool t i don't know i just like that cool tone cool, cool warm tone i don't even know but like just like this 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 style i don't know but i just like the like ucky colors i don't know okay you're just gonna need embroidery floss i'm not gonna show you all that i have but you're just gonna need embroidery floss embroidery floss you can get it at walmart you can get it at hobby lobby that's where i got mine from i got 20 of them they're like a few cents a piece so it's like a few cents just for like um how much is in 8.7 yards of embroidery floss and just this one little thing and it's like just a few cents for each of them so i got 20 right here this is 20. you're gonna need some scissors and then you can either use tape or if you are like say you're sitting in my class or whatever and you want to make a bracelet real quick get like these little safety pins and then you can just like like hook it on to like your clothes or whatever and then just make yourself a bracelet and what i like to do is i like to watch dexter or like youtube videos that's what i've been watching lately dexter if you have not watched it's on netflix you should go watch it it's about a serial killer it's pretty dope yeah i just watch tv and youtube or whatever and then i just pin this to my um i pin this to my blanket um like my comforter or whatever and then i just make bracelets while i watch the tv it's they're super easy to make but some of them are a little bit time consuming so just do them when you're doing stuff and since i'm grounded baby i don't have nothing to do so i just watch tv and make bracelets all day like my anklet one you can add beads into your bracelets so basically you'll just like um, make a knot, do your design, make another knot, add the beads, make another knot, do your design, and then make another knot when you're done. And that's like basically how you do it. Um, these beads are just, I got them from Hobby Lobby, and they just look like this. I don't know if you guys can see that. But they just look like this, and they're just like lines of beads, but you can get like, um, just like the single beads, and then just put like those little beads in there. Like if you want like to put like a letter or whatever, like this bracelet I have, but this is just like a beads bracelet. Like you could have like any of like the these beads or whatever and then put those on your bracelets i think i'm gonna show you guys i don't really only know how to make three different designs right now i'm still working on the fourth one so if y'all want to update a video on this whenever i learn how to do this chevron bracelet and then i'll do that but i don't know how to do the chevron yet i'm not that skilled but i do know how to do this bracelet which i really really like and then i know how to do this style and then i know how to do this style on my anklet so if you guys want to know how to make these nice bracelets, then just continue watching. So for bracelet one, you're going to need three different colors of embroidery floss. And then you're just going to take your three different colors and cut it to whatever length that you want. I normally get a lot of embroidery floss because you don't ever know if like you're going to need more or less. So it's just better to be safe than sorry. 
but you're just gonna make a knot at the very end and leave a good amount of room so whenever you put it on your wrist or wherever you're gonna wear it you have enough to tie it but you're gonna take your safety pin and then just put it through the knot and then hook it to wherever you're gonna work off of so whether it's your clothes your blanket or whatever and then you're gonna take your embroidered floss and you're gonna split it up into your three different colors so for your first color you're gonna make a four around your other two colors and then you're going to pull it up to the very top and you're going to do that for as long as you want your first color to show and then you're just going to repeat that step for all the different colors. Now that you're done with your first color you're just gonna pick whatever color you want out of your three colors and that's gonna be your second color and then you're just gonna do the same exact process that you did with your first color with your second color and then repeat that for your third color if that makes sense so basically just repeat the steps with your next two colors repeating the process with all three colors your bracelet should be done so you're just gonna unclip it from wherever you had it clipped to obviously and then you're just going to have a bracelet that looks like this So for bracelet number two, you're going to need four different colors or you can use as many colors as you want, but it's just going to take a lot longer if you use more colors. But just like we did with our bracelet number one, we're going to make a knot to start off the bracelet and then you're going to take your safety pin and put it through and then just attach it to where you want to make your bracelet. And then for this bracelet, you're going to want to take your four colors and you're just going to spread them apart. and then. For the first um, layer, this is kind of like a diagonal, so you're going to take what your first color and you're going to make a four around the next color and then just pull it through just like we did with our first color, except for this time you're not doing it around all of them, you're just doing it around one strand at a time. And you're going to make two, you're going to go up twice and then move on to the next color. start back over from the left and work your way over to the right with all of your colors just like you did the first round and then just do this over and over again until you have the desired length of your bracelet.
process over and over again the bracelet should the bracelet sorry the bracelet should start to look like this and then you'll just get this diagonal pattern and then once you're done with however long you want your bracelet to be just take it off make a knot and then it should look like this So for the third bracelet, you're just going to need three different colors. So you're going to start off by making a knot and then you're going to leave a little bit of your string. Um, this one, you don't really need to do any of the like pulling or anything. You're just going to leave a little bit of string, make another knot and then get your beads and then basically just get your bead out. Sorry, this takes a little bit, but get your bead out and then you're going to thread your string through the little metal hole just like I'm showing here. You're just gonna thread it through, pull it through, and then flip it on the other side, thread it through again, and then you're gonna make a knot to hold that in place, and then just leave another, like, leave a little bit of room, and then make another knot to where, like, how, whatever the, like, size of your wrist is, and then make another knot. If this makes any sense, I'm super sorry. This one's a little bit, like, complicated to explain, but I promise it's the easiest one to do. And then just make another knot, and then you're done. sorry if the camera is like crooked or whatever but that i just showed you guys how to make three bracelet <laughs> three bracelets today so i just made this like um like pink blue and like teal one it was really cute that's like the first style it's pretty easy um i hope i explained it really well in the video and then this one honestly it looks like kind of like snake skin i don't know it's pretty cool but that's what these bracelets are right here this um i don't really know it's just kind of like a diagonal pattern and you can use more than three colors to make it thicker or whatever but um i just use three colors because it's easy super cute and dainty but you can use more than three colors and it'll look um, a lot bigger and yeah just more colorful and then this one is the one that i have on my anklet so basically this one's the easiest um literally all you do is just make knots and then just put um the little jewel in there you don't even um tie any of it but you can put the jewels in there with any style so if you wanted to put jewels with this one all you would do is just do your pattern make a knot put the jewel in make another knot and then just continue your pattern you do that with any pattern you could do it with this pattern or you could do that with chevron and you could do it really with whatever you have those are just the three i made today but if you guys like this video give it a thumbs up um you guys should send me pictures of your bracelets that you, you're gonna make because i know you'll make some because you won't be like me yeah so if you guys um make any of these bracelets just um send me a picture in the either on my snapchat or anything like that um i would love to see some of the bracelets that you guys come up with and create and the colors that you guys use and maybe i'll steal some and make myself so yeah um i hope you guys enjoyed give this video a thumbs up if you did like this video if you didn't i'm sorry um hit the subscribe button if you want to see more of my videos and also hit the notification bell if you want to be notified when i post but yeah i'll see you guys in the next video bye